Another developing story we're following. Just within the last 30 minutes, the coroner's office released the names of those two innocent people killed in a crash during a police chase in Arapahoe County Tuesday. Now, the chase started in Douglas County. Uh, deputies pursued the suspects for miles until it ended in that tragic crash. And Denver 7's Jennifer Kovaleski is in the as at the Douglas County Sheriff's Office right now. So, Jim, what do we know about these poor victims? Ann and Shannon, the coroner, as you mentioned, just released their names, 25-year-old Jane Davidson and 27-year-old Ryan Carter. They both lived in Littleton. We're told Ryan graduated from Heritage High School and that Jane grew up in New, New Jersey. Tonight, the Douglas County Sheriff says his deputies were doing their job and followed policy. I'm the sheriff of Douglas County. I'm very close to my community and uh, the community supports the decisions of the Douglas County Sheriff's Office. Douglas County Sheriff Tony Spurlock is standing by his deputies. I believe that our policy is sound. And his chase policy. Less than 48 hours after the pursuit of a stolen car ended in a crash that took the lives of two innocent people at Santa Fe and Mineral. I do not believe the chase caused the accident at all because we weren't chasing that Mitsubishi. We couldn't even get close to see what kind of car it was. This newly released dash cam video shows a black sedan flying down Santa Fe at the time. Sheriff Spurlock says deputies were actively chasing another stolen car when the Mitsubishi caught their attention. Still on the wrong side. You see an oncoming car here. You can see the green light. You see the red change to green and the crash has already occurred. Our deputy comes up on it here. They say this woman, 20 year old Deanna Bixby, was the driver of the Mitsubishi, which was also stolen. She's now under arrest and expected to be charged for the deaths of the two people in the car she hit while speeding. Investigators now believe she was likely working with the driver of the car they were chasing, part of a rash of car thefts in Castle Pines. This is a tragedy on a number of cases. We have individuals that come to this county to steal from the people of Douglas County and then put other people's lives in danger, to include my deputies, um, uh, speeding away recklessly, armed, um, and then um, uh, collide with another car that's on the roadway. It really is a sad story all around. And here is the bottom line. The Douglas County Sheriff says that their policy says that deputies can chase stolen cars when they're a threat or danger to the community. He says that's what happened here. And they also were chasing a car that didn't end up causing the crash. They are still looking for the driver of that car. For now, we are live in Douglas County. I'm Jennifer Kovaleski for Denver 7. Yeah, truly a tragedy. Thank you, Jen.